that song said, if you're in the battle for the Lord and right, keep on the firing line, right? So we have to keep firing, right? We're going to win. Hi, Jay. Amen. Let's stand together, please. We want to welcome you to the house of the Lord this morning. And God is so good, isn't he? And we want to give him thanks today. We can turn to hymn number 170. Uh, this song was written by a man named Henry Smith, I believe it was. Check me on that. But anyway, uh, Henry was a... Is that right? Yeah, right. Henry... From the time he was born, he had an eye problem, and he kept getting more dim vision. Vision was kept getting dim. He finally made it to college and seminary, and then he was finally declared legally blind. And uh, so, therefore, he couldn't pastor a church, so he began to wonder what in the world he could do. But you know what? He realized he couldn't pastor a church, but he said, you know what? I'm going to give thanks to God Amen. anyway for what he's done for me. And that's why he wrote this song. And I got to thinking, if a guy who knew that he is going to be limited to what he can do, can just sing and give thanks to the Lord. Surely we can sing it this morning, right? Give thanks, please. Got him home. 
Amen. Praise the Lord. Anyone else? Yes, Bill. Um, there's a, a young man. He's two and a half years old. His name is uh, Dylan um, Kaiser. Kaiser. Sorry. Uh, his oldest brother plays ball with Tristan, and his younger brother plays ball with Will. Um, his dad called me last Monday because his brother had missed um, basketball tryouts. And he said, I mean, I could tell in his voice that he was tore up, and he said that um, they diagnosed Dylan with leukemia. And they think that it is the curable type of leukemia. And they said they're going to do some more tests on him tomorrow. And I'm not real sure what the family situation is and where they stand with God, but I told uh, Ray on the phone, I said, well, I said, we're going to pray for you. And I said, I'd like to have prayer with you right now. And we prayed over the telephone, and these boys play ball with a lot of our kids here at the church and everything, so we started kind of calling around. Um, I got word on Tuesday afternoon that they had done a spinal tap on Dylan, that there was no leukemia in his spinal cord, there was no leukemia in his brain. <laughs> Um, they put a pick line in and started his uh, chemotherapy. They expect him to be in the hospital for a couple of more weeks, and when he leaves the hospital, they expect him to be leukemia free. Amen. Amen. And uh, I talked to Ray by text message this morning, and he said that uh, uh, Dylan was asleep right now, uh, but he has a big appetite. Amen. And that's great, but this is just a, a precious little boy with uh, with a lot of life left in him. Amen. And I just thank God so much that he answers Amen. prayers. Amen. 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 I give thanks for my daughter who's been starting for treatments. Amen. Yes. Amen. I just want to say I'm very thankful for 88 years God, God has given me. Amen. 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 Brother Tom, our sister Barbara went for her second Therapy and she's going to approve. Right? Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. Wow. Lots of praising for, huh? Praising for, praising for this nation. That we do have a lot of problems, but I wouldn't want to be anywhere else. Right. Right. Amen. While we have trouble with our health care, we obviously have good health care here. Amen. And Amen. I'm thankful. I'm thankful for this nation. Yes. Amen. Anyone else? such a difference in my life. I may not have the blood tie to you, but I have a tie that's even stronger because we're all children of the King. Amen. And we all know the same Father. Amen. Um, I had the privilege of Catherine and I having the act team last night. These girls have such a passion for God and a love for Him. And I'm thankful for the parents that have brought these girls up that way. And I just pray we can continue on teaching <laughs> them and, and them receiving them like they are. It's amazing. Amen. Amen. Anyone else? Tom, um, we have a little girl in our um, school system. She's like 10 minutes in the She has a brain tumor, and it's not looking good. But she started radiation, and um, they're giving her past the holidays now. So her family gets to have her for the holidays. And have a dinner for her, and they've raised about eight hundred dollars for like, traveling funds, and that doesn't include like gas cards and gifts and all that. Amen. Amen. God's good, isn't He? Amen. 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 Well, I tell you what, since we're standing then, let's just sing another song before Amy comes to sing for us, all right? Come, you thankful people, come, all right? And as we come, we need to learn to praise Him because the Scripture lesson this morning says, Praise you the Lord. Praise